What is up, y'all, and welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, let me welcome you. Thanks for stopping by. We are playing the beautiful Hamptons Golfing Country Club. And if you're thinking like I'm thinking, we just got hornswoggled because this ain't the Hamptons. This is the great value version of the Hamptons. But neither here nor there. It's a beautiful little course. You just watched my tee shot go right into that freaking lake up front. Take my YouTube drop, chip one up there. Aimed for the big spot of the green. Not trying to do nothing cute, nothing fancy here. Just play some uh, straightforward golf. Uh, something I've kind of been working on lately. For one, going out there and just really having fun. Two, uh, try to play smarter golf for whatever that's worth. Um, left myself a, a pretty lengthy putt. Try not to do nothing stupid with that either. Just roll it close to the hole. Uh, I did end up playing my best nine holes that I've ever recorded. And uh, I kept it under 40, so that's a huge win for a high handicapper such as myself. Um, I, I don't know if that's good or bad. This was a short course. Uh, I think it was overall like a, a par 61, so it's a very short course. Either way, I'm riding a high horse. Doesn't matter. I kept it under 40 for nine holes. That's fantastic for me. Go back to back par threes on them. I hit a, uh, I hit a high hard one. Thank God for the oak tree. That drive would have landed in Grammy's tee first thing this morning. Took me a minute to find my nugget. That grass is tall and thick. Chipped it back across the green. The putter's been pretty good to me up till now. Uh, I send one back out past the planets in the solar system. That one stopped somewhere around where Pluto used to be. Uh, outside the leather, so ain't no gimmies on camera. Uh, squat down, reline it up like I know what I'm doing here. In case Grammy's got her head out the window keeping an eye on me, I'm going to give her a show. Bringing us up to our first par four. I did not get to hit my driver at all on these nine holes. I did hit my uh, five wood a couple times. And uh, it was just lights out golf. I, I don't, I'm still speechless really. But uh, grip it and rip it, piss missile right down the middle. Uh, I'm standing there, I can't believe it. I'm like, holy shit, is this really happening? I'm inside of 100 yards. I get to break out my wedges. I follow that piss missile up on a rope at the flag stick, draw it back, sling the old sea needle right at it, just harpooning, just dropping shots in on the flag. Straightforward. Uh, it's a little uphill, I think, maybe, but straightforward. I'm on in regulation. I'm, I'm, I'm on in two. Putting for birdie. That shit never happens for me. All you gotta do is hit the ball. My skirt blew up. Save myself a little tap in par. Parmesan. Pardon me. And we just keep it rolling. Take a quick look around. My last and final hole is another uh, dog leg left par four, real tight fairway. Woods on both sides. There's actually a little bit of water up front just rock back and fire one down there i about hit too much club i gotta take a squat down i'm blind as a bat so i think it's safe it was uh grass was tall it was wet stopped it from going over in dilly weeds save myself another wedge in and i pull a rory i choke 
I plowed the shit out of the earth, came up short. I'm not in trouble. Uh, line two, green side. I can get this ball up and down, still save another par. Just got to make a good chip. And it, it was, I just, I guess I had a little bit too much spin on her. She kind of checked up on me. There's my par putt. Didn't hit it. Tap it in for the, uh, the Vogue. And that's my four holes this week. Thank you guys. Love you. And we'll see you next week.